it's Anne welcome back to the channel before I continue let me just apologize in advance but I have my grandkids here and family here so it is a bit noisy so if you hear any noise I apologize in advance anyways I just wanted to give you guys a quick tour of my bedroom and just show and just share with you what I have done for the spring season and um, I just wanted to create you know a really light eerie fresh look in here so i shopped my home and i'm gonna take you closer to the so like i said i shopped my home and i've just used all of these beautiful velvet um creamy pillow covers from amazon and then i've added some silver satin pillowcases which is really good for your hair to my pillows at the back I got rid of some of the pillows because like I said I wanted my room to be light and airy so I didn't want a lot of pillows on my bed and then this cute 12 by 20 pillow came from Amazon and the look that I've created is in my room was just to complement this canvas art it has a lot of um, grays and silvers and whites and black and gold so I wanted to recreate that look and um, I think I've accomplished that. I really love how everything looks. This pillow cover is also from Amazon. And like I said, it's 12 by 20. I've added this full fur gray, black and white throw blanket, which complements, you know, what's going on in the pillow covers and everything on the bed. And then the vase is from HomeSense. I've added some peonies. And then I still have my mirror over there with some boxes on the floor, which has, I'm storing a few things in those boxes. And then I've just added my full fur stools that I got from JISC to the end of my bed. If I wanted to sit down and like, you know, put some cream on, cream my skin or when I'm going to bed at night, somewhere that I can also place my pillows as well. The, um, throw blanket is from Amazon and as you guys can see I've moved my nightstand I've also pulled the bed out a bit to sort of center it just a little bit in the middle of the room and still allowing that I have enough you know of a walkway over on this side to get into my bed so yeah that mirror is a full body mirror and it's from JYSK 
this cute faux fur rug came from HomeSense and I think I purchased this maybe three four years ago um, as you can see I've removed my nightstand because it was taking up too much space here and the drawers were actually facing the bed and I've brought this cute little table up from the living room the table is from HomeSense and I purchased it maybe five six years ago my Bible is there, a picture of my grandson, the florals are from Amazon, the vase is a DIY that I got from Dollarama, spray painted it black, and my lamp is from HomeSense. The lamp was I think $59.99 and I have a second one out in the hallway. So yeah, and I think I mentioned all of my pillow covers are 20 by 20, they're all from Amazon. The gray satin pillow covers pillowcases are from Amazon as well all of my inserts are from winners slash home sense and all of my bedding is also from home sense my sheets my um, duvet cover is from Jisk, and then I have a white comforter inside that I got from home sense and this is this side of the room with my bed and this is what it looks like when I'm standing by the door with the door closed. I'm still working on my window treatment. I have someone that's going to come in and put up my curtain rods. And I'm still deciding on what color curtains that I would like to put up there. You guys all know I love black and white. So I'm thinking about black because my bedroom is facing the front of the house. And I get a lot of sun coming in. So I'm not really sure if I should do gray or like a gray silver or should I do black. I kind of want to give my room a little bit of a different look from the rest of the home. As you guys know back in the apartment, I pretty much use a lot of black and white throughout the whole space. But now that I'm in a home and all the bedrooms are upstairs, I, I want to give my room sort of a different look. I'm, I'm still going to have black accents in my room because I love black. But I want to, um, you know, add some other colors to it. And I love silver. So I may put some silver gray curtains up that still, you know, blocks out a little bit of the sun. So um, that is what I'm thinking. Um, I have two wall sconces that will be coming probably in another week. I ordered them from Amazon. They're black with um, silver. They're sort of like this. You know, the, sh the chandelier with the little um, crystals that they have hanging from them. So I have two wall sconces coming that will be going on opposite side. And then I'll have someone come in and put up a chandelier for me as well. The chandelier is actually going to be black. The shade will be black. And then I'll have the crystals hanging to complement the wall sconces. And it will also complement the canvas art. So here is where I've placed my nightstand. And on top I've added my glam mirror trays. Both trays came from Amazon. And I have all of my perfumes. I have my mirrored boxes that keep rings and extra jewelry. And I've just added this really nice glass vase that I got from HomeSense about three years ago. I have a medium sized one to it as well. And I've just added some greenery. These palms are from Amazon. It actually used to be downstairs in the living room on that table in a black vase. And I just decided to add it up here because I wanted a little bit of greenery in my room. I also plan on adding a plant over here. This is my closet. I won't be showing you guys it. It's a little bit on the smaller side from what I had in the apartment. The great thing about it though, it has a lot of length. So I'm able to add um, a lot of shelving and fold my things, so which is really great. But the inside needs to be reconfigured a little bit. Um, yeah. So for now, I won't show you my closet until it's finished. So the closet needs to be finished. Wall sconces are on the way. I have my black and crystal chandelier coming. And then a silver, most definitely I'm thinking silver curtain panels will be up here. And yeah, I think I love this 
creamy white sort of bedding and it still goes really nicely with the black inserts of my headboard so I like how everything turned out I like how eerie fresh and light and the illusion of space that I'm getting from this refresh anyways guys thanks so much for tuning in today i hope you guys enjoyed this little refresh of my master bedroom for the spring 2022 um if you did give this video a big thumbs up comment down below and if you're new to the channel welcome 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 thanks so much for clicking and watching um if you've enjoyed what you see definitely subscribe to the channel double tap your post notification bell that way you'll always get alerts you'll always get alerts each and every time i upload a video i want to thank you all for watching have a beautiful and blessed day and i will catch you guys in the next one bye guys Oh, 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 oh,